Hi everyone, this is Nathan again with the ebookreader.com. I just got done posting a uh, video about multi-touch on the Kobo e-readers, so uh, I wanted to post another video here real quick showing the uh, inverted ink where you can do uh, the night mode. This is another simple hack that you can install on most Kobo e-readers, the Kobo RHD, Kobo Glow, Kobo Touch, I think even the Kobo Mini, where you can get the inverted text so the text is white and the background is black. I posted a, a how-to on the, my blog a long time ago about this. I thought I put together a video showing it. Apparently it didn't, so uh, here's the video. Uh, you can go ahead and see how it works here. Um, let me increase the font size a bit here. So everything is inverted, as you can see. The menus are inverted. Everything is what is normally white is black, and what is normally black is white. So, I mean, it extends to the whole device. Let's go to the home screen. So the home screen will be inverted as well. So uh, it just sort of uh, works that way with everything. It's really kind of a cool feature if you like reading uh, with black background and white text, white text instead of the usual uh, so uh, the only the way you turn this on and off is you hold the uh, light button. So if I hold the light button, then it'll go ahead and turn the uh, it'll go ahead and turn it back to normal. And so then this obviously it works with the light as well. So once you uh, turn it back on, you can enable the light. So there we go. And since I have the uh, multi touch, I can darken and brighten the light with two fingers on the Aura HD right here. So. Uh, check out ebookreader.com. Like I said, I had the uh, tutorial posted on this a long time ago, how to invert the uh, text on the Kobo Aura HD. It's an easy hack that I found via mobile read. Uh, you just basically put a file on the Kobo and it'll install it itself. It's really, really easy. So um, I'll have the link uh, to the written review uh, underneath the video. So check that out and uh, thank you for watching.